Hi students. Okay, today learning the topic is change of variables in double integrals. So change of variable means the Cartesian x comma y will be changed to the a new variables. The totally function will be changed. Automatically we getting the x limits and the y limits also changed into a new limits and new variables. So that is called the change of variables. So in the previous lecture we completed change of order of integration. So change of order of integration means only limits or will be changed. Function no change. Limits y y limits converted to x limits. X limits converted to y limit. That is called a change of order of integration. But here change of variables that means function will be changed. The new variable is converted to the new variable. So that is old variable to the new variable. Now finding the also finding new variables limits and finding the integration. And the function will be changed automatically. Variable change that is new variable limits are changed. Okay na. So that is equal to here see the first definition. So first of all Cartesian to another Cartesian coordinates. So if f of x comma y any integrable function and we use the transformation t to make the substitution and the transformation one variable to the other variable here substituting x is equal to x of u comma v and y is equal to y of u comma v and the new old variable is x comma y so new variable Cartesian coordinates u comma v the new Cartesian coordinates u and v and x y is converted to the u and v now u, new limits is u and v so therefore integration over r f of x comma y dx dy is equal to here integration over r dash f of x comma x of u comma v comma y of u comma v mod do of x comma y by do of u comma v the do of x comma y by do of u comma v means jacobian already we will discuss in the previous lecture jacobian of the two functions x and y with respect to u and v now finding this is one of the application of jacobian so jacobian means the connection with the old variable and new variable that is the old variable x and y with connection to the new variable u and v so now finding first jacobian in the substituting okay na that means dx dy is equal to jacobian into du dy so that is equal to here where old region or in the region the limits are x limits and y limits so new region or dash or dash is the u limits and v limits and dx dy is equal to do of x comma y by do of u comma v into du by dy this is the Cartesian to another Cartesian coordinates these are change of variables so next to second one Cartesian to polar coordinates Cartesian to polar coordinates polar coordinates means x is equal to r cos theta y is equal to r sin theta and x comma y is converted to the new variable r comma theta that is equal to given function f of x comma y substituting the uh, polar coordinates x is equal to r cos theta that is x of r comma theta y is equal to r sin theta that is y of r comma theta so then automatically the integration is integration over r f of x comma y into dx dy is equal to integration over r dash f of x of r comma theta comma y of r comma theta into jacobian it's do of x comma y by do of r comma theta into dr d theta so that is equal to integration over r dash f of r r cos theta comma r sin theta already finding the jacobian of the polar coordinates is r and the do of x comma y by do of r comma theta is equal to direct value r r into dr d theta this is our new variables r comma theta new limits r theta where x comma y belongs to r and r comma theta is belongs to r star and dx dy is equal to r dr d theta so this is a Cartesian to polar coordinates see the example First example, evaluate integration 0 to infinite 
integration 0 to infinite e power minus of x square plus y square into dx dy by changing to polar coordinates hence show that integration 0 to infinite e power minus x square into dx is equal to root 5 by 2 so this is a very very important question long question so given integration 0 to infinite integration 0 to infinite e power minus of x square plus y square into dx dy okay first of all given limits here x limit 0 to infinite y limit 0 to infinite and both limits are constants that is only 0 to infinite positive infinite and both and that is only region of integration consists in first quadrant so observing here the given function is also x square plus y square here so my given function integration law will given x square plus y square then using must be polar coordinates getting the easily integration only there is a fixed law in the given function x square plus y square given by using only polar coordinate change of variable so now x comma y is converted to the polar coordinates let the polar coordinates x is equal to r cos theta comma y is equal to r sin theta so x square plus y square is equal to r square and we have dx dy is equal to r into dr d theta and directly formula and dx dy is equal to r into dr d theta so that is equal so given reason is lies in first quadrant only see the graph gotcha. so this is x axis y axis so this is x limits so 0 to infinite and it is mottam 0 to infinite and next y is equal to 0 to infinite this one only the region of indication lies in first quadrant so now assumption x square plus y square is equal to r square and a circle here circle and a radius is the radius and or when kela want to the integration what is the reason up to infinite here 0 to infinite here. so r limits is also the radius is infinite of the circle and is starting from 0 to infinite or limits 0 to infinite and theta limits the first quadrant theta limit 0 to start and up to y axis means 5 by 2 and the theta limits is 0 to 5 by 2 so that is equal to or limit 0 to infinite theta limit 0 to 5 by 2 now finding the integration by using the new limits So integration 0 to infinite, integration 0 to infinite, e power minus of x square plus y square into dx dy that is equal to integration theta is equal 0 to 5 by 2, integration r is equal 0 to infinite and e power minus x square plus y square and x square plus y square is equal to substituting r square. Oh no? So that is equal to e power minus r square. Next into dx dy is equal to r into dr d theta directly substitute dr now finding the integration so integration 0 to 5 by 2 so e power minus r square at the e power minus r square integration minus r square derivative 2 r there is no minus 2 r so dividing multiply with minus 2 r dividing multiply with minus 1 by 2 so that is equal directly integration e power minus r square integration e power minus r square so r limit 0 to infinite substituting here minus 1 by 2 e power infinite and e power minus infinite means 0 e power 0 1 so this is a constant here indication of 1 with respect to theta 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 limit 0 to 5 by 2 so that is equal to here 1 by 2 5 by 2 minus 0 that is 5 by 4 so this is the required value of the given integral so by using change of variables okay now cartesian to polar coordinates so now finding the remaining value now so we know that e power uh, integration 0 to infinite integration 0 to infinite e power minus of x square plus y square dx dy is equal to the separate integration and because e power minus x square into e power minus y square the separating integration limits also constant so that is equal to integration with respect to x this is integration with respect to y 
so that is equal observing both are same same integral kada function same e power minus x square and limit 0 to infinite so variable different but function same integral same and so which is can be right and which is equal to value the left side value is already finding 5 by 4 so 5 by 4 is equal to this is a both are same integration 0 to infinite e power minus x square dx whole square on a hence square root on both sides integration 0 to infinite e power minus x square into dx is equal to root 5 by 2 okay this is a required value see the next example evaluate integration 0 to a integration 0 to square root of a square minus x square y into square root of x square plus y square dx dy by transforming to polar coordinates see that so given 0 to a integration 0 to square root of a square minus x square y into square root of x square plus y square dx dy so x limits are x is equal to 0 to x is equal to a here y limits function of x you know? y is equal to 0 to y is equal to square root of a square minus x square so observing here this curve is y is equal to square root of a square minus x square means uh, simplification squaring on both sides that is x square plus y square is equal to a square circle and with the radius a so that is equal to let the polar coordinates x is equal to r cos theta y is equal to r sin theta and x square plus y square is equal to r square and we have dx dy is equal to r into dr d theta and radius is r is equal to a so clearly the given reason lies in the first quadrant because x limit 0 to a 0 to a a is a positive number so that is a only lies in first quadrant so see the graph so this x axis y axis so this is the circle this is a circle is equal to given curve y is equal to square root of a square minus x square Today with radius a or is equal to a in the only first quadrant y is equal to 0 to y is equal to square root of a square minus x square and y axis x is equal to 0 to a comma 0 and a point a comma 0 and intersecting 0 comma a gather on a assumption in the theta limits the first quadrant only 0 to 5 by 2 or limits starting from 0 to radius a so or limit 0 to a so or limit 0 to a theta limit 0 to 5 by 2 so this is a new limit after changing the variables now finding the integration integration 0 to a integration 0 to square root of a square minus x square y into square root of x square plus y square into dx dy so that is equal to integration theta is equal 0 to 5 by 2 integration r is equal 0 to a y y is equal to a r sin theta is substituting so r sin theta into square root of x square plus y square means square root of r square gana. x square plus y square is equal to r square into root of r square means r okay next to dx dy is equal to r into dr d theta now simplification is integration r is equal to 0 to a r cube dr into integration theta is equal to 0 to 5 by 2 sin theta d theta that is equal to integration is r for 4 by 4 0 to a minus cos theta 0 to 5 by 2 substituting the limits a by a for 4 by 4 minus 0 minus 0 plus 1 that is equal to a for 4 by 4 this is the required value of the given integration after changing variable cortisone to polar ok yeah this is the topic is change of variables in double integration for more videos please do subscribe my channel like and share it thank you